the Strike 80 80% frame is finally back in stock. Hey, what's going on world? It's William with the Crossfit Army Holster Company. There is one thing that I love as much as shooting and making holsters, and that is building guns. So we're gonna get straight into this. If you saw the title of the video, you clicked on it, you probably clicked on it because you saw the title of the video. So let me go ahead and pull out my Benchmade Sock P to get this baby unboxed. And we're gonna look at it and see it. Now, I know most people have already seen an unboxing video for a Strike Industry Strike 80 80% frame. Strike Industry Strike 80 80% frame. I wonder if they did that on purpose. Uh, anyways, I know a lot of people have probably already seen those unboxing videos, but this isn't just about unboxing the gun. This is to celebrate one very important fact, and that is that, file that to the side, the Strike 80 80% 80 frame is finally back in stock. At the time of this video, the black one only is available on uh, primaryarms.com. The link is down below. I don't care if the anti pew tube says that we can't link the gun parts. Um, you did miss the sale as of right now. So as of right now, they're back up to the normal price um, of $141.99, which is still about eight bucks cheaper than they were going for um, at the price of $150 when they first came out last year on the Strike Industries website. And we know that I think only one of the site at that time had them and then they sold out right away as well. And I was one of those few few people who was trying to check out on their website and I just wasn't able to because they were having so much site traffic like their, their site like crashed maybe a hundred times no exaggeration um, that night so I'm finally getting one and you guys if you wanted one you can get one now also again primaryarms.com the link is down below in the description section they are in stock at the time of this video so this video is getting done and edited all within an hour <laughs> to make sure that you guys have the chance to actually get one and i'm going to make sure before posting the video that they're actually still in stock once they sell out i'm going to keep monitoring it throughout the day and throughout the week even maybe um and um you know just update you guys you know if you care i don't know but anyways yo let's go ahead and get inside the box yo Come on. All right, Joe, so here we are behind the camera and of course the Strike Industry Strike 80 packaging. A little more, uh, probably about the same as the uh, P80 packaging. You know, same size, I would say. The box was a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be, but here we are, boom. We got our rails, looks like pins and drill bits. Just like P80 packaging, nothing inside this Ziploc bag looks different that I can see. Yeah, I think we're good to go on that show. Um, and then of course the standard jig, and this also looks just like the Polymer 80 jig um, that you would normally get as well. But let's go ahead and pop this out the jig. I'm gonna put this other stuff down, literally. It's down and we're gonna go ahead and get into this. So again, difficult to do behind the camera, but let's go ahead and slide it out. Perfect. And let's get a look at this frame. Let me put this down real quick. I'm not gonna drop this. Oh, back in it. So, yo, yes, yes. The frame feels very nice. This is my first impression. I've never touched the Strike 80 frame before. I will say that uh, it does come with some advantages over a P80. So let me go ahead and pull out one of my P80s real quick. Boom, this is my EDC. This is the Strike 80, P80, Strike 80, P80, Strike 80. Um, and you can probably see some differences. I'm being very cautious of the trigger because I just pulled this gun out of my holster and it is hot. Bump the lips for the mag check. I don't really care about that, y'all. So you can see, um, for one, the accelerator cut um, on the Strike 80 is obviously way more um, detailed than it is on the Polymer 80. And for me, that, that's real big. That is actually very, very big um, because I love being able to dig 
my thumb, you know, thumbs forward grip into those accelerator cuts. And I did notice it to be a little bit shallow on the polymer 80. I'm gonna go and put this back up. Go ahead and get back to the strike 80. A moment. Boom. And back to the strike 80. So everything again about this frame looks almost identical. You can't register it if there's no serial number. <clears throat> Anyways, a <laughs> little bit of shade on that. Um, I do like the little strike industries branding right there. I like that they didn't put it on the um, on the little corner of the stippling like polymer 80 did. I like that. Um, I do like these groove cutouts right there. I can really feel how my palm how this part of my palm here is gonna fit right into that during shooting. Um, I love the beveling around the mag, um, the mag catch, well, mag release. Um, I think that is incredibly dope. I'm not gonna lie, man, just like the, the frame itself, it does appear to have like a little bit better finishing to it. Like it, it just feels I don't know, something about it does feel a little bit different than the P80 frame. For you, for those of you guys that, that have one, you probably know exactly what I'm talking about. Like, it feels very similar, but it feels a little bit better at the same time. Um, I do, the grip, I am kind of used to the more ag aggressive gripping on the um, P80 frames, but that doesn't feel bad at all. If you have a FN509 or have ever shot a FN509, you know exactly how this kind of ribbed you know, texturing feels on guns. It feels good. It's not like ultra grippy. It doesn't feel like it's gonna get, you know, slippery in the hands. Um, yeah, but this is pretty much it, y'all. You know, I mean, there's not really a whole lot to get into with unboxing videos. Um, I can't wait to build this thing, see what it's like. I mean, you got the same little cuts right there for your guide rod and spring. And you got the tab cuts that you're gonna have to make um, for your slide rail. Um, but that's pretty much it, man. This Strike 80 thing is, is nice. I cannot wait to build this thing up. Y'all saw the midnight ride and how that came out. And here we are with another very beautiful black frame. And this thing is definitely going to get built up something serious. Um, oh man, I also got, got a little bit of beveling right here around the pin cutouts as well. You know, that's, that's actually really nice. It's actually really, really nice. Anyways, though, as always, y'all can sell your weapon, not your fate. Love y'all. Until next time.